you're a new band, you shouldn't be hard on yourself. You should just be like stoked that you're writing music and using that as an avenue to get over whatever it is in your life. And if it sucks, brilliant. At least you're doing something creative, you know? Like it's better than working a nine to five or, you know, just doing something not, um, not cool. <laughs> graphic design at university so um, I kind of fell in love with it because of the whole like expressive kind of art I suppose art with a bit of organization to it I guess um, and then in the third year um, that I was there it started getting like I guess graphic design for business came in um, like obviously getting you ready for the real world and stuff like that um, and I just wasn't into it. Man. Like, I didn't have the attention span for it. Um, I, you know, I wanted to, you know, get my hands dirty and do, you know, expressive stuff. But it was, it was this whole like, okay, you've got to sit down at the computer and make sure all these words are exactly aligned. And it's, it's kind of, yeah, the whole, the whole idea of being artistic for somebody else because you can come up with like the most amazing idea or the, the, that you think and you have some, such a passion for um, and then somebody will turn around and be like, nah, that's not what we're looking for. I designed our current logo um, and that, that was, that was a, a tough one as it was because I, I, I had said to myself from the beginning that I didn't really want to design for the band. It was actually one of the first things that I, I did that was kind of, yeah, these guys quite like it. But that was really easy and nice. But ultimately, from the beginning, I sort of said I didn't want to do it just because it's, it's tough because it becomes like a passion thing then. Um, and you, because I'm involved in the band itself. You know, we've got such an amazing group of people around us. We've got an incredible label. We, the first time today we met the, the American side of our label and they're, they're amazing and they're so on board with what I'm writing and what we're doing. Um, but you know, I'm, I'm greedy and I already want the next few steps and stuff. So sometimes like the hardest part for what I do is, um, you know, you go through so much stuff uh, like health wise and, and you put so much time and effort into it to get to like this stage that sometimes if like a bad bit of feedback comes back or something like you haven't hit the amount that they wanted or something, that's really hard for me to take because you know, I expect just brilliance all around I want to do thousands and thousands and thousands of records so it's quite hard it's quite a tough pill to swallow when things are taking a bit more time but writing wise I'm not that I'm not that hard on myself really I kind of feel like the way that I write I just let everything off my chest and I think that's good in its own way I'm not one of these people that will play around with a song for like a month and be like oh it needs something else like lyrically sometimes I'm like that um, but I tend to think however that song came out at that time is how I was feeling, so that's great for that, that point of time. And especially the way that we write as a band, um, it's all very natural and honest. Um, so yeah, with that, with that regard, I don't really put too much pressure on myself with the writing. I feel like I'm writing a lot, and I feel like the new stuff's better, and I'm feeling really confident about that. So mine's more uh, like the long term, the big sort of aspect of it. I think... I think because I'm quite an anxious person, I like knowing everything that's going on. I like just being told where everything is. The f you're exactly right, I should just be like, you've got the album now, oh god, it's a relief. But I'm just then like, oh, but actually, what are you guys doing? Like, is everyone okay? Are you alright with press? Like, we should be doing this. Like, I'm very hands-on. Um, so I just, I just worry a bit that, like, sometimes we're not getting the right things, or sometimes we should be, we should be aiming higher, you know? Um, Personally, I think it's a good thing because it means I won't ever just be like, yes, right, you know, because I'll always want to do something better. All right, so I, I suppose my struggle is confidence. I've always wanted to be in a band since I was about 11. Bums, Nirvana, that kind of thing. Awesome, thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Um, so I was kind of just like, I want to do this. So I just got a guitar and tried to play guitar. And I just, you know, obviously at first you can't, you don't know what you're doing. Um, I'm self taught with drums as well and uh, went to uni to study film. So I've been a filmmaker, like freelance on and off since I graduated about five years ago, I think. 
And um, that's very kind of competitive world, you know, there's a lot of competition out there. And that's great, but it just doesn't sit well with me. I, don't, I feel that art shouldn't be like that. But, you know, in that world, it's great. Um, and I suppose from doing that, again, that, a lot of that self-taught, just getting out there in the field and learning from your mistakes and adapting. And it's just the same with the band. It's uh, never feel like it's good enough. I always want to be better. And that's my struggle, I just have to say. Yeah. And we did a song, and I had a real... T I, I thought I had a tough time cracking it. And I went into the control room and was like, oh, that was rubbish. And our producer was like, no, it's really good. And played it back to him and I was like, no, that sound good. So I think it's just in my mind. I'm always putting myself down. It comes in waves. Um, most of the time I feel great, but then there'll be like something. If I like if we play live and I'll, something goes wrong, I'm just like, and it puts me in a bad mood for two days with myself. No, I think you need to be hard, hard on yourself. Um, I don't know. I, I disagree. I think you should be happy with what you write. And it is going to suck to start with, and that's cool. Like it, it shouldn't be perfect. And I think you should. Um, you sh yeah, I, I don't think as a musician you should be that hard on yourself early on because else you're never going to get to a good stage because everything will suck. So just be proud of what you do.